the channel everybody <sighs> we're still flying along with the 370 update uh, I think I found a bit of a gem I think I found a bit of a gem the uh, line 6 oblivion it's one of their original amps again I said this the other day if you were with me uh, the new range of amps that they're, that's in there now bit of a force to be reckoned with um, they feel great they sound Amazing. Um, some of them have got this boost system that's in there as well. Uh, and yeah, it's it's all good. So two presets today. One is kind of a metal, straightforward, kind of, you know, detuned kind of thing. And the other one is I've just slotted that amp into a previous patch that I've done before. And then I've took some stuff out uh, and thrown the Oblivion in. And it's, yeah... Picking the right drive pedal for it, though, because I did put a drive pedal in. So, anyway. All right, let's quickly take a look at this, and we'll go through as, as quick as we can, because I know people don't like to hang around. Uh, simple pitch. I've got this set to E-flat, uh, hence why I'm using the EVH guitar today, which will become apparent in just a moment. Eh? Uh, drive is on 7.1, uh, bass is on 4, mids I've, I've kind of pulled back, not dramatically, but just enough so it gives you that kind of metal edge. Uh, sag is on 4, normally quite l a bit lower than that. Uh, kinky boost in between the amp and cab, I'm just running the one single cab, which is the double XL V30, so this will go in your HX stomp as well. Calligraphic EQ, just to pull out some of the shittery uh dynamic room on the end because it's a metal patch you know, we don't want to be you know going all kind of mental uh and that is that so basically what's this for is i've got that set to e flat so i have to turn turn the mic off otherwise you'll hear the normal standard tune guitar and then the e flat and it all sound fucking weird <laughs> And then obviously with it being the EVH, stop cracking that mic with me at. I can do the, uh, the D flat. Uh, the open D thing. Kind of in tune. So that's your first one. <laughs> kind of in tune. Was Eddie Van Halen ever in tune? That's what you've got to ask yourself. Was Eddie ever in tune? I don't think he was. I don't think he was. Uh, lead Oblivion, uh, same thing. Feedbacker, why? Because it's new. We all like new things. Uh, I've gone for the valve driver in front of the amp because I just think it sounded tighter, if that's a thing. Just nicer, I think. Uh, drive is 6.6 .6 on the amp. Not really done too much, just kind of pulled stuff back a little bit, pulled the presence back. Uh, sag is on 3.5, turn the hum off, and I've left the bias and the bias X where it is. Normally, I would kind of play around with that a little bit, but again, the job that they've done kind of out of the box, it sounds pretty damn sexy to me. Uh, dual cab on this one. Uh, 4x12 double XL V30 and the 1x12 epicenter. A little bit on the EQ mod chorus because I don't need like loads of it. Uh, plate and a tile on the end, and that's it. And it's just one, it's just one snapshot. That is all it is. It's nothing else but that. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
show you what that tube driver is doing on and off Probably my me f- me favourite amp at the minute. Probably my favourite amp. Uh, I think it's really, really good. It's very, very powerful. It's clear. It's uh, It feels good under the fingers. Um, so, yeah, there you go. Another day, another couple of presets. You know the routine. I don't charge for any of this stuff. All I ask is that you hit subscribe. And if it worked out for you, let me know. If not... Let's try and have a good day.